Alrighty, what's going on there? So, I decided to make a different video. Well, video today. Basically, it's what do I have in my denture drawer in the bathroom. I'm not in the bathroom because I use my laptop and, you know, it's easier. Instead of holding the phone and all that. So, first thing I would have when I get up in the morning or in the afternoon when I put them in is bucket. Get my teeth in them. Ah, minty fresh. Okay. So I soaked them last night. And I rinsed them well, but they still have that little bit of whatever flavor to them. And then I've learned was that when I take these, I put these in. I leave this open in the drawer that way it dries out completely because like the first couple weeks I did it I'd shut it after I took them out put her put them in my mouth end of the day this thing was bad so don't do it leave it open if you can or maybe I don't know they probably make some with holes in them on top I don't know either way okay so then I have My fancy denture brush that I got from my denture lady. It's supposed to be softer than a regular toothbrush. I don't know if it really is, but I like it just because, mainly because of this part. You can get down in the. I can't really see this. Get down in there. So. Gotta have a toothbrush. I brought everything outside. Obviously. Denture soaking, denture cleaner it says. I don't remember what brand this is. I want to say it was in a green box. Poly grip? Poly, no. Not grip, but Effordent maybe. I think it's the three minute one. I soak mine in these two, three times a week, and I usually soak them overnight. I know, I think they were the three minute ones, but I've seen other people and read that it, you can leave it in longer. I hope I'm right. I hope I'm not giving people bad advice here, but I'll leave it in overnight. And then in the morning, I just... I'll put this in the sink. Put the teeth are still in it, right? Just flush them with hot water for you know a couple minutes. Usually gets rid of all the fun taste. Okay. Then I got this was fix it in plus. This was the first. Um, what do you want to call this stuff? Adhesive. I bought. I got a sample of Fixident when I got my dentures from my denture lady. And I thought it worked fine. It still does. I haven't used this in a while. It's been a couple, it's been a while, months. So, but it works. It does help. With stuff getting under, it really does seem like it seals. Then I have Secure. This is what a lot of people swear by. Um, I got this free. They had on their Facebook. Um, they had a link, not a link, but it was some. If you messaged them and asked them for free samples, sometimes they have some. So I emailed them once, or sent them a Facebook message to ask they had, and they didn't have any. They said, try back in a month or so. I tried back. They did. Took my address. Sent me this. This is their normal, full size, what they sell. So, you know, this, I haven't used this in a while either. But, this seems to work better than 
my Fixident Plus Precision Hold and Seal. So this is just secure. The waterproof denture adhesive. 12 hour holding power. Good value. One time a day. Now, uh, it says zinc free. This does not say zinc free. Yeah, right here. Contains zinc. I know a lot of people get worried because they see things that say zinc free, so they assume zinc's bad for you. I think in order for the zinc in this to be bad for you, you're probably going to have to eat a whole tube. I don't think once well, a day on your gums is really going to do anything. You might be allergic to zinc, but then obviously there's a spider crawling at me. Son of a gun. Okay, we're moving the feet. Sorry, I'm in the garage. What do you expect? But I don't think most people really have to worry about zinc free. This is zinc free. Bonus, I guess. Then I have. Actually, this is usually. Okay, hold on. Either I killed it. Or I really pissed it off and it's going to call its friends and come back for me. Um, Reline it. This is what I have right now on my bottoms. I have each box comes with two. One for your tops, one for your bottoms. I have denture fit in the tops right now. And it still works well, so I've been using this on my bottoms and it works good it seems to be lastable that is not right seems to last monthish or so directions are upstairs in my room so but this is just one whatever serving size left because I already used the other one in my bottom bottom ones so I usually have this in my drawer or I have it out here in the garage in the freezer because you definitely the directions say freeze it for like three minutes I'd freeze it for as long as you really can just it's not gonna hurt it it's gonna make it last before it hard sets up it's gonna take it longer so you have more time to get them in and get them straight so oh yeah then i have my handy bottle of probably can't read my writing poison a little skull and crossbones right here but this is basically dawn dishwashing soap probably that much soap and then it's water and then i just took a regular old water bottle poke the hole in the top of it so before I use it I you know, shake it up distribute it evenly and then I'll use this to brush my teeth with especially if I'm gonna do a reline it or something you want them super clean and that will get them super clean and one of the products said crispy clean and you know you just sprinkle spray a little on there get your bad boy out soap them up rinse them off and then <clears throat> you're good to go they're clean I wouldn't recommend soaking your teeth in that I don't think it's blue I don't know what that's gonna do but I just use it I don't use it every morning but I'll use it probably well it averages about once a day sometimes I don't do it right away sometimes I do it later that's about it um gonna say something else very brilliant and I totally forgot what it was I don't know so I guess that's bad I'm getting hard reline Monday honestly think it's gonna happen to cancel like my last three but this one's going on so Saturday or Sunday I'll be picking all the the reline it out the denture fit out and all that 
Um, if you guys need, I'm gonna try. I'll try to find the link or the Facebook group page, whatever it was, where I got this secure. I mean, this is. I don't remember what this is, but if you can get it for free, free shipping, free, it works. It's good. Wait. I forgot to show this. Okay, this is my fix it in powder, which is, I can see in here because it's light. It's like up to there now. This is what I generally use. It works well. It... I don't know. I just seem to like it. Everybody's different. Everybody's got their own taste flavors. Everybody's body reacts differently to different chemicals. So, this works for me. One thing I learned, I saw it on a Facebook group, is that, okay, I'm not going to actually do this right now, but, hold on. Like, when you're applying it, okay, like, say this is open, right? And you're pouring this in, right? Now you want to shake the excess off. At first, what I used to do is shake it, tap it, you know, get all the excess off. I mean, they're wet when before you start, so it sticks to them. I just tap it off in the sink, right? Well, that leaves a nasty sink residue. It's all sticky. Which is what it's supposed to be, I guess, because it's an adhesive powder. So what I've been doing, I've either been using less and trying not to get excess. They really have to shake off that much. Or, when I do, I brought a little Tupperware type, Tupperware bowl up there. And I shake it off into that. And then, I did that for like, I don't know, a few months. And surprisingly, where is this? This top part. Oh, yeah. You could you could open it, right? So after a couple months, I had a surprising amount of it left. I took that part off, kind of just poured it back into here, and it refilled this thing to over halfway so that'll make this last a lot longer not that it's really expensive necessarily but hey three bucks is three bucks whatever this was five bucks I don't remember just a tip it works it helps you will save a lot more of it than you realize okay I think that's really about all my denture gear that's about it for now. I brought it all out. Yeah, that's it. So, all right, guys. I will probably be back Tuesday after I get my hard reeling. Hopefully, it's wonderful. If not, you'll know. All right, bye.